Hi everyone, I'm Martin aka Steve McQueen and welcome back to Project Cars 2. Okay, we're going to crack off on our career. Um, yeah, did a initial setup, that was a couple of weeks ago now. Uh, wow, doesn't time fly. Um, so yeah, haven't actually driven the game yet. So uh, yeah, this is going to be very interesting. But we are starting off uh, in the Formula Rookie cars. And uh, yeah, we're going to see what we can do. So bear with me. Um, yeah, as I said, haven't played it yet. So uh, basically just done the initial graphics setup, uh, wheel setup, pedal setup, graphics setup. And uh, yeah, that's about it. So yeah, let's jump on in. The career dashboard is the main hub for managing your career. Under the home tab is everything related to the current course series you're participating in. Here you'll be able to head onto the track for each round, view the event calendar, check emails from your team and others, view your series standings and read news headlines from your prior races. Okay. Right. Let's, let's have a look. Welcome to Dragon Drop Racing Team. Yeah. Okay. New race engineer. Okay, beautiful. Back. Earning affinity with specific manufacturers by driving their cars in your career will allow you to unlock manufacturer drives. Okay. Invitational events are awarded to you throughout your career progress. There are invitational events for various motorsport disciplines and they can be participated in and replayed anytime, as many times as you want. Cool. Here you can view your career's progress you can also see which trophies and accolades you've won, as well as what you have left to accomplish. This is also where you can set the difficulty levels for your opponents in your races. Alright, yes, that's what I am after. Okay. So let's put the opponent skill up a little bit. Um, as I said, I haven't played this, so I'm not sure how aggressive. And from all the videos I've watched, um, yeah, difficulty uh, changes from track to track, uh, car to car, which makes life a little bit e uh, difficult. Um, I'd like it to be, you know, pretty stock standard, but anyway, it's not. All right, so let's try that. So 70% uh, opponent skill level and 60% opponent aggression. Uh, restarts, I'll keep that on for now. Only, as I said, I haven't, I haven't driven this at all yet. So we'll go with that. And uh, yeah, eventually I'm, well, hopefully after this first event, I can turn that off. Alright, let's jump into our first event, shall we? Uh, yeah, let's start. This is the final review of the round you're about to enter. Here you can configure which sessions you want to participate in, as well as their length. Once you're ready, hit start and get out onto the track. Okay, well, I definitely want some practice on. Uh, qualifying, 15 minutes, yeah that's fine. Uh, race length. Well, wow, only 8 laps. Yep, that'll do. Okay, let's do it. Are we Sportland, Sportsland, Sugo. 
Oh, that's right. I'm in Asia. Don't know this track. I've never driven it. So yeah, this will be interesting. It's race time. As you look around the pre-race menu, you'll see a list of all the participants. You'll also be able to view a detailed map of the track by selecting the map icon. If you need to, you can alter your car's setup, as well as pit strategy before the race starts. Additionally, you can customise your head-up display layout and options to suit your personal style. Hit the start button. Practice is about getting to know your car and getting to know the track. Ultimately, it's about exploring the limits of both you and your car. Once you're comfortable with both, use the session to make adjustments to the car's setup and consider creating a pit strategy ready for the race. You can also try turning the assists, such as traction and stability control, off and on and feel how they change your car's behaviour. Okay, so options. Jeepers, greatness. Uh, gameplay, steering assists, no, braking assist, no, driving assists, authentic. Okay. HD, driving line off, turn indicator off, okay. Alright, yeah, we'll, we'll go with this and uh, let's see. Let's see what happens. Go, go, go! Get used to driving in cockpit mode again. Fire the brakes are cold on this outlap. Just take it steady, get a feel for the track, and feel the car's set up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 there she is. Touchy! Qualifying determines your placement on the starting grid for the race. The faster the time you set in qualifying, the higher you'll be up on the grid. This is often the session where your car will be tuned for maximum attack. The setup and strategy tab allows you to change the settings on your car, as well as to configure a pit stop strategy for the upcoming race. You can also view a summary of your current series rules and regulations. Take the car out for a few laps, then return to the pits and try tweaking your car setup to improve your lap times. Uh, okay. 
Okay, tire compound. Tire pressure. I'm bring the pressures back a bit. Done them all round, that's good. Oh, what happened there? Uh, that one. Brake pressure. I'm bring the brake pressure back a bit, locking up slightly. Brake balance. Yeah, that seems to be okay.
fuel. Set up. Uh, back. Pit strategy. Oh, up there. Fuel. Done. Back. Uh, how do we do this? Uh, tuning set up. Fuel. Fuel load. Definitely not. Let's take 12 litres. That should be enough. Do 15. Okay. Uh, save. Save. Alright guys, watch your bums. That's better fuel load. Shoot, it's always blue again. Four minutes. Thank <laughs> you. 
everybody all right so we're gonna have to up the difficulty I don't think we can do that while we're in a session um, so yeah all right, just gonna pause it there for a second guys and we'll be back okay here we go to the race now got 15 kilos of fuel oh so it's in kilos Okay, so the tyre pressures are down, so they should heat up quicker. Uh, pit strategy, I don't think I need one. Um, can I up the difficulty? 
Uh, where is that? I might be in here. No. Okay, not in there. Uh, HUD. Maybe it's in here. The head-up display edit screen allows you to reposition and toggle the various elements and messages that are displayed on the head-up display whilst driving. Layouts can also be created for different camera views, allowing you to customise the head-up display to a style that best suits your individual needs. Okay, so, no, it's not what I needed. Uh, controls. Force feedback. No. Ah, there's the difficulty. Can I change it when I'm in, already in a race? That's a bit of a coup. Camera. Yeah, okay. Performance. Yeah, okay. No, it doesn't look like I can change it. That's a bit of a bugger. Oh, maybe it's in rules and regulations? No, it's not. Uh, pitch strategy? No, I don't, want, don't need a pitch stop, I don't think. Alright, so, yeah. Can't change anything, guys. Um, that's a real bummer. I'm going to have to do that in practice on the next event. I'm going to have to up the difficulty because, yeah, I don't want to do 2.6 two seconds in front of everybody. That's just boring. Uh, I'd rather be in the in the crux of it and um, having a good race. Anyway, let's jump on in. See how we do. It's the first race of your career. Enjoy the ride and bring it home. Restart session. Sorry guys, didn't have to put on the brake. Yes. Okay, brake. Alright, let's brake. Let's start.
Alan can work the loo now. I jinxed myself. So I could make a mistake.
easy, guys. That was... Oh, no, no, no. It was quite fun. Oh, 
don't, 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 don't. Racing is about results, and this is where you can see how you did. All drivers are listed in order of their finishing positions. Along with that, you can see the points that each driver scored, as well as various other bits of info related to each driver and their race. If the series assigns team points, you'll also see how the team scored here too. Come on, take the team, mate. Okay, so uh, yeah, that was the race. We're in pit. Okay, so what have we got up next? Oof, I turn the jumper off. Bloody hot. About 30 seconds till we go. Let's go on. Let's get Where are we next? Don't know this track either. Stay where the track is. First gear, 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 gear. Oh, no, don't mean that. It's alright. Hit button off. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so, yep. Oh, good! Okay, so that is the first event done. Um, yeah. So came in fifth, which wasn't too bad. Um, two big spins. Ended up way back in uh, I think eighth or ninth. Managed to pop my way through to the lead, and on the last lap had another spin, and uh, yeah, finished up in fifth. So yeah, crazy stuff. Alright, gonna leave it there guys. So thanks very much for watching, I'm Steve McQueen. 
Uh, please subscribe, give a thumbs up, drop a comment, and uh, yeah, we'll catch you in round two of my career. Alright guys, until then, be good. See you later. Bye.